Well guys, Josue back again with another video on Hemi Raw and today I want to talk about the secret to happiness. So the road to happiness, actually, actually, not the road to happiness because it's, it's really not a road. There's nowhere to go to find happiness. There's no journey to find happiness. Happiness has always been within you. Happiness has always been here. Happiness, honestly, is a choice. You have free will and you do create your own reality. So in order to be happy, in order to be happy, you, it's a choice, it's a decision. You can choose to be happy or you can choose to suffer. Your beliefs create your reality. Your perception is everything. How you see the world is everything. Everyone, every single one of us sees the world differently. It's our choice. We choose. You have seen how two different people can react totally different to the same situation. What is the difference? The difference is how they're thinking about the situation. It's how they see the situation. It's about how they see life. What is your perception of life? Do you feel like life is something that's like totally against you? Do you feel like life has it out for you? Do you think the universe has it out for you? Do you think, you think the universe doesn't like you? You think people don't like you? You know, is that is that what your mindset is right now? That is where a lot of our mindset is. Right now, fear is rampant. Fear is rampant. Fear is everywhere. It's in our TV. It's in our food. If you're eating meat, dairy, and eggs right now, filled with fear. These animals are suffering. These animals are enslaved. These animals are in cages. And if you look at human beings right now, most of us are acting like caged animals. We're acting like caged animals. A lot of us are claustrophobic. A lot of us are very paranoid. A lot of us just can't get along with each other. We can't even get along with ourselves. And the key to this is, you know, you have to go within. Everything that you need is within you. You need to reevaluate. Re you need to reevaluate what you're putting inside of you. Not just with food, but also, phys you know, also spiritually, emotionally. What emotions are you putting inside of you? What are your thoughts? What, what are you feeding yourself? You are what you eat. Work on that. Work on what you eat. Work on what you consume. You are a being of energy. And everything you see, everything around you is energy. The whole world is energy. Everything is energy. You see this tree? It's not actually a tree. It's energy. It's information. Your food is information. So even if you're eating a vegan diet, which I highly recommend, who's making the food? You know, even if you're eating whole plant-based foods, who's growing the food? Are monkeys picking your coconuts? There's so much that goes. We need to ask questions, guys. We need to ask questions. We have gone to a place where we have become complacent. We have become complacent and we have no idea what's going on inside of us. We have no idea what's going on around us, which means that we have no idea what's going on within us because we're taking all these things from outside of us, putting them inside of us. You know, we're, we're, we're consuming the news. We're consuming music that we're not even sure what the music is doing to us. You know, we're doing things and we don't even understand how our bodies work. We don't even understand how the universe works. Look up the seven hermetic principles the law of attraction this stuff is real you need that spiritual knowledge you need that knowledge of self know thyself but getting back to happiness right getting back to happiness it is a choice you can choose to be happy happiness is right here and right now even if your whole world it seems like it's going to crap you can actually take sit down meditate take a deep breath and then just come and during meditation just look at all the things you have to be you have to be grateful for the fact that you can see, that you can hear, that you can breathe, that you can walk, that you can feel, you have your senses. Maybe you have family, maybe you have a house, you know, there's so many things to be grateful for. Focus on that. And then come out of the meditation just feeling all this gratitude, feeling all this love. And then choosing to be happy in that moment. Because guess what? If you choose to be happy in that moment, everything else fades away. Every, everything else just fades away. Because in this moment, in this moment, you, make, you made the choice to be happy. In this moment, you chose to think differently. In this moment, you took a breath rather than reacted. In this moment, you evaluated yourself. You asked yourself some questions. You did not just keep on living life blindly. You did not just keep on gambling your life away. Take your life seriously, but also don't take it seriously. You know, don't take yourself too seriously, but know that you create your own reality. And if you don't know this yet, Feel free to check out the videos on my channel. I talk about this all the time. Once you focus on that, focus on remembering that you actually create your own reality. Just pay attention. Be aware. Look at the world around you. 
Everything outside of you is a reflection of your subconscious mind. You're living the world from inside out. So look around you. Pay attention. Pay attention to the words that people are saying. Pay attention to the subjects that come up. Pay attention to the things that catch your attention. Pay attention to the numbers that are repeating. Pay attention to the animals that show up in your life. Pay attention to the interactions. Just pay attention and pay attention to your body. You have more than one body. Of course, your physical body is also a representation of your subconscious mind. And then you have, you have the world as another body. That's why like, one of my first decisions was to not litter. Because this is my body as well. And this is your body. We're all living in this body. And it's our body. We are a cell within a cell within a cell within a cell. We have cells inside of us. And we are cells inside of Mother Nature. But we are all connected. You know? And being happy is you, you got to feel safe as well. So get to know your mother. Get to know Mother Nature. Go out in Mother Nature. Take off your shoes. Ground yourself. Walk around barefoot. Allow Mother Nature to heal you. Allow Mother Nature to embrace you. Go to the beach. Go for a swim. You know, and just, just ask the universe. Just ask the universe for whatever you need. Ask the universe. Ask and you shall receive. And get to the point where you feel safe you know when it was when i went out to nature and then my a voice in my head finally told me i was looking at the trees and it was like my god they're so connected the trees are so beautiful they stand tall there's so many of them and yet they're not fighting for resources they're not mad at us for what we do and then i heard a voice in my head told me it's all connected and i felt it throughout my body the truth is inside of you everything is inside of you stop looking outside of you things outside of you can't help but the truth will always be within you and when you find the truth when you find the truth that you need to hear the real truth because there's so much misinformation out there, you will feel it in your body and you're not gonna need, you're not gonna need anybody's validation for your truth because you felt it. You experienced it. So that's my video for the day, guys. Go out there and experience life. Go love life. Life is what you make it, man. You do create your reality and go out there and create. We are creators. We're not consumers. Stop consuming so much. Start creating. Start expressing. Start being you because everyone else is taken and you do not need to be anybody else. You don't need to compare yourself to anybody else. Don't even compare yourself to me. Just be you, man. Be you. If you like this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.